everybody, it's Tyler Kepke along with Coach Base. Today we're going to bring you another tutorial video, which I call the Step Curry Series in the half court, using our inside out dribble to set up our pick and roll play. For the first action that we're going to do today, we're going to start around half court. So we come into the get and come into the pick and roll situation like a game. Once you're attacking full speed, getting the ball to the wing position. Okay. Once we're at the wing position, we're going to protect the ball, get the ball to our right hand. You can do that in different ways, whatever way you feel comfortable. You bring it through your legs, the cap behind your back. But most importantly, we want to make sure that we keep the ball protected. Now, once the ball is in my right hand, okay, we're going to get it here. Be a big side step inside out like we worked on in our previous attack series videos and as I do that I'm trying to get my defender to bike go down so then I have a great angle to come off the screen and I'm going to run my defender into it when I set him up I want my eyes on the rim I want to come off shoulder to shoulder so tight around the cone then we want to get into the middle of the paint get two dribbles left right pull up Okay, now the second action off this series is everything's going to be the same. I'm going to come down, protect the ball, get the ball to the wing, set up with my inside out. And now that I've come off a couple times, my defender's probably going to jump up, trying not to let me use the screen. I'm going to use a counter. In this case, our counter, we're going to set up with an inside out, go behind the back. Just one of Steph Curry's favorite counter moves off the inside out. option we're going to use now that we've come off the screen we've hit him with the counter we're going to simulate that I hit him with my inside out and he jumps back and goes under the screen so as a good offensive player as soon as I do my inside out and I see the defender go back under I got to raise up into my jump shot okay, one key detail that I want to emphasize when, we, when we're pulling up for a shot behind the screen is our footwork because efficiency is key in this situation so what I want to show you is when I hit my defender with this inside out as a setup and I see him jump back and go under, my footwork is going to be right left. So in slow motion, inside out, pull back, right left into my shot. Now the last option in this series is splitting the pick and roll. So one thing we want to really emphasize again, is making sure we bring the ball down to the level of the screen, getting the ball to our right hand where we can protect it, hitting them with a good inside out, big side step and head and shoulders. Now as I come off, I have to recognize right away if I'm gonna split. It takes a good player to be able to recognize this and I'll know, as soon as I hit him with my inside out and start to come off, I'll know if that defender's jumping out. Now one key point here, when you try and split, I come off, I want my shoulders facing the other sideline, it's gonna be a low crossover, nice low and tight and through. I'm gonna protect the ball the whole way and go through. 